Media Vision. <coughs> Gotta watch the cool anime opening for this game, too. Or not. I'm gonna set the title screen to see if there's a cutscene that explains the backstory of one of the characters. Or is it just gonna fade to silence and nothing happens? <laughs> okay, I don't think anything happens. Oh my god. Yes, start a new game. Here it is. Here we go. Yeah, get it? Second Ignition, as in Wild Arms 2. Eye patch character. Anime water. It's not. It doesn't. It doesn't feel like that. Uh, the old wild arm starting thing. Do I want to be a young man ready for action? A former hero now war criminal, or a sorceress just getting started? We gotta go with. Do it in order. We'll start with the young man. Ready for action. We'll pick the cute girl later. I already picked the young man. The cute grill is it's too late. It's too late. Oh my fucking god. I now know that the kidnappers are holding the boy hostage. Up ahead in the old excavation site known as the Withered Ruins. Time for the final mission check. It doesn't look as bad on stream. Playing this game upscaled to 1080p on a good monitor, this font is like impossible to read. It's a newly formed special unit. This mission isn't active and probably won't get chosen. What are you babbling about? What's your name? Yes. His canon name is Ashley. I can roll with it. You know why I can roll with it? 
because Bruce Campbell's character in Evil Dead is also Ashley. <laughs> so, here we go. I like you that are most dangerous in the field. It's Ash. Yeah. Don't get in the way, I understand Ashley. I'm just gonna call him Ash. The third mission is a rush into the ruins where the hostage is held. It's critical to secure the safety of the hostage first. Numerous monsters have been sighted at the ruins, so don't let your guard down. Okay, let's go charge. Ah. The music in Wild Arms 2 is bomb. Why is the Wild Arms 2 music so good? Uh. Points because we're playing Super Mario RPG now. I'm not sure what to play here because the treacherous ruins have been left abandoned. Keep continuing, you'll be fine. You return to the condition you're in before the battle and you get to redo it. Yeah. Like. What did this game come out? Two thousand. There was four years. There was four years between Wild Arms One and Wild Arms Two. You can you can move the map with the camera. It's, it's, this is very uh, it is very Breath of Fire. -y. It's reminding me a lot of Breath of Fire. Now that I've played Breath of Fire games, you know, the three guys who came to the town of Marion's laborers to make money. It is very Breath of Fire. -y. Care. Does that still do MP? No, oh, it boosts force gauge. Oh yeah, I don't have I don't have MP. I have flower points, or as I'm pretty sure it is, is force points. Can I still bonk in this game? Sure can. He's even got like a little animation. His eyes get all buggy. Big improvements already between Wild Arms 1 and Wild Arms 2. The expedition team called Merc. This place is also called the Withered Ruins. To carry out your mission, just don't kill yourself. you in here before collapsing, my duty is to protect collapse. Cool, we got a healer. Seriously, so we're taking over my monsters. Brace yourself. First guy here ran through, through the fog, fell into that hole here. Could you check it out? Sure, I guess. How about I go this way first? 
Well, there's one. Yeah, well, there's one was remade for a reason. That is true. Bum, bum, oh, the battle theme. I can't not hear Goji sing the battle theme now. Oh no. Strength thief. He stole my strength. This game is way louder than the last Wild Arms. Audio balancing, what is that? Who does that? Man, the music is so, so bomb. Gotta play it, go, go just singing it on repeat? No, yeah. I should I should take the clip of Goji singing it and make it an alert for the Wild Arms <laughs> series playthrough. Oh, hey, there's that guy. He's dead. Do it. I should. So good. I'm already sick of the motion view though. Question is, is this game also gonna have a hard to find map that I'm gonna have to go back and find ten hours after I already could have had it? Yeah, pretty much everything is better. Bum, 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 bum. This, this is better. Get rid of motion view. Motion view is cool, but it, it just makes it take longer. I wonder what this looks like if I put smoothing on. I'm going to put smoothing on just to see how the PS3 smooths this game. To see if it looks any better. Motion view is, it's like when you're doing fights, the like, uh, the camera like moves around and stuff. Whoa. Smoothing's actually pretty good. Yo, smoothing, yo, PS3 doing work right now. Wow, the PS3 actually does really good smoothing on this game. Score big here. So you be assigned to the new unit. This one, I can read the text. Take it easy. Stay here until the rescue team arrives. Hey, look at that. Whoa.
Wow, PS3 actually doing work. Jeez, besides just turning the switch, you need to figure it out. Wow, I'm actually like... If you hooked up with this digital and start this right, you could. Yo, the smoothing is actually really good. I am... This is like the most impressed I've been with the PS3's PS1 smoothing ability. If you wanted to, yeah, if you wanted to. Come to the edge of a floor above a drop of character. May make of the oops action. In the oops state, you can press the X button to go ahead and jump down. Dashing off an edge without the oops action. Okay. Hillberry. Wow. I am like, I am like genuinely blown away by the smoothing that the PS3 can do for this game. Because sometimes the PS3 smoothing on PS1 games just is not good. It's really bad. But this is pretty legit. But to see what it's like in a battle. But so far I'm impressed with the overworld smoothing. Yeah, wow. Bam, 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 bam. <laughs> Here it Goji. Your song is stuck in my head. Yeah, I usually don't either. I usually don't play PS1 on PS3 because there's really no reason to. But man, the smoothing. The smoothing, I can dig the smoothing. Am I going to level up from this fight? I did. Yo, he kind of looks like Bruce Campbell, too. Do I have the Goji singing clip? I do. I sure do. I sure do. I gotta find it in my list of things. Looking at you, looking at each other, winking and spiking all the way. Do, 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 do. <laughs> it's like. Somebody must go over there. There it is. Can't see the graphics this game so far smoothing or otherwise. I don't mind it. Actually, he looks like Bruce Campbell in combat. It's kind of funny. Looks great. Maybe he used to touch up the Rudy Sprite. I wouldn't be surprised. This game reminds. This game is like it's giving me Breath of Fire vibes. It doesn't have as good a sprite work as Breath of Fire, but really nothing has as good a sprite work as Breath of Fire. <laughs> oh boy. Of gems, the faintly sparkling levels, jewels of life to restore lost HP. Gems heal all members of the party, but the amount of HP restored depends on the size of the gem. Oh, Mr. Man, what are you doing in here? Put your footing above here, watch for signs of giving. Oh, by mistake, you'll be held up like me. Oh, I see, I already see where it's going to fall, right there, and there. Mm -hmm. 
Gagesson. Disease. Cool, I have a disease. Thanks. Oh, he gave me medicine. How nice of him to give me a disease and then give me medicine for it. One costume on Spider Man. Gotta be hard mode. Oh man. Time to be time to get real good at him. Gotta be the best Spider-Man there's ever been. battle sprites are still kind of like suffering from being just polygonal messes of monstrosity things but I said that was the one that was gonna fall, and that's the one that fell, and I didn't. I still. I. I derped a derped. Makes you invisible, but not for bosses. You gotta be the invisible man. The invisible Spider Man. Visible Spider Man. Well, the boss is all cheat. They got wall hacks. time out of battles is it's a bit longer than Wild Arms 1 was. Take it slow and proceed with caution. There's gotta be treasures in here, right? I'm digging the music. The music is is really pushing me through right now. I can see what this guy can do later. Oh boy. So I have played a little bit of this game in the past, but not very much. Like I got, I, I've gotten to disc two, but that was like many, 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 many years ago. And by many years ago, I mean like. 20 years ago because this game is almost 20 years old so and I haven't played this game like since then so it's pretty much all new to me I don't really remember any of the story or any of the characters yeah it is a blind run I can do leaving the rest of two. Uh, how close am I to leveling? 22 experience. I'm gonna level up once more before 
Since there's a dude here that will heal me, I'm just gonna level up here real quick before I fight the boss. It's only gonna take like three fights, two fights, two more fights. The music reminds me of like Final Fantasy VIII for some reason. At least the beginning part. The beginning of this song reminds me of Final Fantasy VIII. Did I get into a fight, please, game? Wild Arms 1 had way, way too high of an encounter rate. Wild Arms 2, you can't get into an encounter when you want one. And some Sonic. Yeah, a little bit of Sonic in there. <laughs> Disease. No, he's going to make me sick again. One more fight and I should level up. I think I need what? Four experience to level up? Yeah, four experience. It says right there. Next four. It also kind of reminds me of Vanguard Bandits a little bit, and I think that's just because I really, really want to play Vanguard Bandits again. Say that game? Why? I love Vanguard Bandits. Vanguard Bandits is. What is this? A save point? This unusual object is called a save point. This amazing stone has the power to save your adventure to a memory card. <coughs> wow, what's a memory card? I love me some Vanguard Bandits. Vanguard Bandits is my favorite strategy RPG. All you Final Fantasy Tactics nerds can get out of here. I mean, I love Final Fantasy Tactics as well. Don't get me wrong. But if I had, if I was given the choice, I'd play Vanguard Bandits over Final Fantasy Tactics any day of the week. Oh no! Oh no, Adam. Vanguard Bandits looks cooler. It is cooler. I'm trying to get. I want to get Walt to play Vanguard Bandits, but you know, getting Walt to play a strategy RPG is like pulling teeth. <laughs> it took me like it took me like two and a half years to get him to play Final Fantasy Tactics in dance and I didn't even really want him to but it's a thing that happened is there trash hey you like the Fire Emblem game so <gasps> a strength apple
I mean, I find strategy to be fun, so what, what does that say about me? Oh, the kidnappers! How a little abduction was to bring in comfort to our lives. <laughs> Kidnapping was impossible for us from the start. We plan on doing boss. It's about time these musketeer, those musketeer boys came charging in. Shut up, Zook. Whoa, whoa! The real man would do something. Hey, Gerg, Gerg, we got Gerg and Zook. What are, what are these names, Gerg? <laughs> these are like names that I would come up with. After much thought, it's clear it's clear that kidnapping is no answer. Didn't I say that at the start? What, giving predictions of disaster before we even start? What a waste of manpower whipping out like that, really. Zook and Gerg. These, these are definitely names that I would come up with if I had to name these characters. Yo, one of the Wild Arms games, the last Wild Arms game, is a strategy RPG, and I've never played it, and I'm really excited to, to check it out. A trump card. I get away no matter what. Nothing good is going to come from holding me hostage. To start, I have no parents, so who's paying the ransom? Hey boss, did you hear that? <laughs> They're from the big dingle. The, the dingle. That's my hopes and dreams. Hey, kid. Hey, hey! But who are you? I've come to save you. Are those three the only kidnappers? Yes. Good, you did well. You have a name? Of course I've got a name. Tony. <laughs> yep. He looks like a Tony to me. Okay, Tony, quickly, can you work with me? What do you want? Draw their attention. Sure. Wait, we got a deal. Hey, old man, how dare you treat me this way? You don't have the guts to properly kidnap anyone. What did you say? Did you grab the brat and shut him up? Wow, are the three stooges here? If you can. Oh, well, way to go, Tony. Hold it right there. Huh? What? I forgot Wild Arms 2 does this with bosses. Vanguard, hey, as long as you get Vanguard Bandits. Wow. I don't know why, but I had a feeling something like this. But I need to find my copy of Vanguard Bandits. It's in a, it's in a tub somewhere in one of the two closets are full of tubs that I have. Bite your tongue. Oh, please. You too. Oh god, look at that thing. Whoa. Slowly turned. Run away, Ash. Granger, a large life form has been confirmed in the ruins. Most likely, the trapped monster was released by accident. Unfortunately, highly, highly volatile liquid explosions have been found in the monster's secretions. Maybe at this rate. What the? Boss is having a seizure. Yeah. 
course, the soldiers in the ruins to evacuate immediately. A huge explosion is possible, so we can't handle it above ground. Minimize casualties, we must destroy the entire ruins at once. At least the safety on the large arm. Oh, the wild arm is getting crazy. Authorize the use of the railgun. Can we destroy the entire ruins? We still have soldiers left in the ruins. Possibly the monster could escape before all of them evacuate. By destroying the ruins, some soldiers won't escape in time. Are you gonna let them die? Yeah. I'll take full responsibility. Ah, what a man. What a guy. What a friend. What a buddy old pal. What a friend of mine. Dude! Wait, why did he say dude? Thank you immediately. We'll finish things off with a large scale arm. Large scale arm needs. But our team is still in the back part of the ruins. Did you do that? I think Vanguard Bandits only has one disc. I think, I'm pretty sure it's one disc. It comes in a two disc case though. Like, Wild Arms 1. It's one of those games that comes in a two disc case, but it only has one disc. Disobey, you're in violation of regulations. You're gonna sacrifice someone even if it is for the larger good. It's not just me, the commander and everyone else here doesn't want that to happen. Our heart should be one. Please order those remaining in the ruins to evacuate. Even I can manage to stall for time. I'll stop this one. Varg! First boss fight. Yeah, I think it's a demo for... I think it's a demo for one of the Lunar games. Maybe Lunar 2? It might be a Lunar 2 demo. Bosses can be attacked in two different places. The main body and the body parts. Defeat a boss character by attacking the main body at its name... And reducing its HP to zero. It's an HP to zero for the body parts. Once defeat the boss, but we'll win XP and Della. Oh. Yeah, Luna 2, yeah. Which is another great game. The Luna games are pretty fun. How much health do you have on that claw, man? I'm killing the claws. I'm getting that experience. One day, yeah, probably. I know. I know you are. I'm waiting for it. I've been waiting patiently. Are you starting with one? I forgot. I'm pretty sure you're starting with one, right? I haven't played Lunar 1 in so long. I haven't played either of the Lunar games in so long. One is uh, Silver Star Story. Yeah, Silver Star Story. Lunar 2 is Eternal Blue Complete. I, the, the, the easy way to remember that is 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 the the easiest way to remember which one Lunar One and Lunar Two is is that the subtitle for Lunar Two rhymes with Two because it's Lunar Two Eternal Blue. Yeah, uh, working designs did that a lot. A lot of working designs games have multiple variations. As we found out when I was trying to help Walt get copies of Lunar. Oh look, he's presenting himself to me now that I broke his hands. Versions reports, yeah. Got 
got him. He presented to me even more. A hundred experience. Big Berry times two. Big Berry. Yeah, he looks like Ash. From he looks like Bruce Campbell's Ash. They totally were going for that with this character. Where'd the sound go? Oh, there's the sound. I wonder which copy, I wonder which variation Goji got from the smoker's house. <laughs> yeah! You come step around. I your orders and took matters into my own hands, and I prepared for my reprimand. <laughs> they hope so. The punishment for this incident will be forthcoming. Until then, you are under house arrest. Is that all, sir? Any objections? No, no, sir. No, no, sir. And that is how the this extremely long day ended for the new recruit. So, oh, yeah. I did what I thought was right, but it was a violation of orders. Probably. If this game turns out to be a carbon copy of Wild Arms 1, I'm going to be very upset. No one wants to see anyone get hurt. You know, the destination is the same. Different people choose such different routes. I don't understand. I just don't understand it. Oh well. With my sentence, I have plenty of time to think. Yep. Rudy. Okay, cool. I get to save. How nice. All wild arms are the same. It's all this one game. There's no, there's actually no differences. It's all just the same game. <gasps> now we get to do this again. Hold on. Uh, you guys can pick which one I do next. I'm going to go check the mail. Because I think, I, the mail still hasn't come. I don't know what they're doing. They've got a, something up their ass. But here you go.
Okay, I'm back. What happened? <sighs> She's five, by the way. Fine. Fine. I still work for free, you know. Be more worried about a work about a Merc who works for free. Merc who works for free. Har har har. What are you laughing about, you old geezer? Let's see in this interest. Okay, we must plan a counterattack. Ha! Wish someone would do something. Sorry, sorry, sorry for being late. I haven't quite got the knack of this teleport gem. A minute I thought I had teleported to the wrong place again. Uh-oh. This isn't the Valyria household, is it? I knew it. Excuse me, but who are you anyway? Is she picking her nose? Or is she pointing at herself? Lulka, huh? up again. But at least one came. At least I came. At least one. <laughs> the 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 lowercase L and the uppercase I are exactly the same. I've been resting here for a while. Oh. Weird how so they dump that stuff on rice to eat it. So gross, right? Try this nice warm treat. Oh god! Mmm. <laughs> uh, I killed myself, dude. You <laughs> feel better now? <laughs> Uh, that's the way I act, I was just so nervous. I just can't get the hang of the teleport gym, you know? An item used for moving around? No. It's not for that. I'm studying magic, and this one item just seems to have it in for me or something. <clears throat> wow, you know how to use magic? Wow! Actually, I'm still learning. Oh, wow, I'm so impressed. Who's this little shit? I'm be impressed. Anyone can use magic, you know. You mean even I can learn magic? Of course you can. For instance, you can pick out a loved one's voice or your own name in a noisy room. That's kind of magic, too. Get it? No, I don't get it. <laughs> I don't get it at all. No? Oh. But you will someday... Magic is a power that anyone can use. Magic can do anything. What the hell is going on? You. <laughs> the Super Mario RPG sound effects. You. <clears throat> Millennium Puzzle. Of course. Of course the grill also plays into Walt's love of puzzles. So what am I supposed to do? I don't know what to do. I can't figure it out alone. I'm gonna be okay. Hey, don't cry. You see the big switch block behind you? Use your magic on it. It'll be alright. It'll be alright. I know you can do it. I don't think it worked. I can't do it. I won't lie or say anything. I'm not good at it like you are, sis. Didn't you fail to control the gate because you didn't do it right, sis? By starting over, this time the door should open. Open, come on, open up. This 
time I'll show you a different method. It'll be fine. This way is easy. So why didn't you show me this from the start? <clears throat> well... <laughs> See, the small switch block just below where you are... It's the same method to sit, get your magic to work. Yeah, you use it. Oh. <clears throat> he says, look, it worked this time. There are three switch blocks left. You need to get all of them. Leave the rest to me. I can manage this. Let's review how to handle a fire rod. Oh boy. Big rods. Screw your magic turns to a flame. We can fight in front of you. Are you okay, Lilka? Lilka! It's quite the name. I know. I'm, I know. I'm fine. This is a piece of cake. What is this? Am I, is this Castlevania? This is like Castlevania music. No flame, freeze, and heal. She's literally Cecilia. Bumping. What is it, sis? Yeah, I get it. That's the door that I need to open. I, I get it. Nothing. Never mind. Be careful. Oh, hey, look, a save point. This amazing stone has the power to save your game to a memory card. As if they know what a memory card is. Millennium Puzzle. I would like to continue the game. Yes. Did this game from Flying Trade 2? Uh, oh god. Well, welcome to the stream. We, I just finished Wild Arms 1 uh, about an hour ago doing all the Wild Arms games. That's kind of the thing that I do for some reason is that I end up playing uh, full series. This is kind of what I do here. Ways to go. We go on the first. Is it very comfy then? Welcome on in. Okay, there's nothing. There's nothing there. That's fine. There's a lot of healing items, but I haven't done any fights yet. What do we? Get? There's a fight. Oh boy. How's FP to do a different gom? Seven inch. Okay, everything costs FP. This is quite the system. Umbrella attack. So slow, girl. Girl, so slow. Oh no. Whoa. Fireballs. 19. Uh, I think that means that they're resistant to fire. What shelter do I have? Try freeze. Oh, 
Aha! Elemental weaknesses in this game. Aha! Aha! Shark beam, what is that? No! No! That would have killed me if I wouldn't have healed. Got him. Eight experience. Oh, she does like a weird jump twirl thing. Oh no. Did you still have everything? Oh, those. Kill 2,000 HP. Whoa, okay. Wait. Oh no, it's a maze. I mean, I guess I go right. So I went left and I came out straight. That sounded weird, but I fell off. Don't move and turn the camera at the same time. Doesn't. Uh, does not work. Oh, there we go. Run, girl, run! The cape flows like... Oh god. Stand on the proper block before I hit the button. The Millennium Puzzle. Oh. Them diagonal shots. Oh, now I'm up here. And now I'm down here. A new way. Is this what happens when I get it to respond? When all the switch blocks respond, the partially open gate gets reset. You can manage that even with my level of magic skills. Right. Hmm. Okay. Go. Oh, fight. I was like, oh, what is. Oh, it's a fight. That's what it is. Okay. with the host. What's up, Richter? Good afternoon, Richter. How's it going? The Bugmans. They can't stand the cold. Level I was only level one? No wonder why. 
They didn't even start her off at like level 2 or level 3. They just started her right off at level 3. Poor Lilica. Okay. Is this... Uh, I think I understand. I need to hit this one. And this one. Aha! I really need to not turn the thing. Don't turn the camera when I'm on the thing. Grease. Grease on Switch. I've heard good things about that game. I have not played it, but I've heard good things. Didn't that game get like a bunch of awards for something too? Oh god, I... I need to get it through my head. That holding forward and turning. The camera is not a good idea. Please, brain, stop screwing me over. Okay. I should just... I should have defended. What am I doing? Well, I actually didn't get... Okay, I'm not getting as much FP now, because I leveled up. We saw Pete, we saw Pete play it. I think that might be where I saw it, too. I might have saw Pete play some of it. Battles are kind of slow in this game. Wow, I'm glad that I healed. Okay. Not shocking him again. No. Battles will probably get better once I get, you know, more than one party member. Things are slow going when you only have one party member. Where am I? Hello? This music is so Castlevania. I don't know why it's... Very Castlevania. Brain, please. This is going to be a common thing. I'm going to fall a lot. Because for some reason, my brain is not adapted to the Wild Arms 2 dimension. I surprised him. Three of them. Oh, God. We have to take a full round of three hits once. She looks like she's always blocking. Because she, she holds her umbrella out weird.
Man, leveling up does quite a bit in this game. More than it did in Wild Arms 1. Wild Arms 1's damage rolls were so weird. I still don't understand how the damage worked in that game. I'm gonna take a turn and heal. Because I can. It just, it seems so random at times. And I'm not talking about Twin Orbs, because I know how Twin Orbs work. Twin Orbs was random. But I'm talking just like regular attacks, because it seemed like there was like a 300 damage variable in regular attacks. Which is ridiculous, it's so much. And then I'd do damage with somebody, and then I would crit on the next turn, and the crit would do less damage than the attack before. Wild Arms 1 had some had a messed up damage system. Why does this look familiar? Am I walking? Am I in circle? Where am I going? Wait. something. I'm so confused. Drop down here. Is that what it is? I can to drop down here. Hopefully. Yeah, this looks right. Because the last time I went up one of these, it took me to the other block. Wahoo! Switch block left. You did really well. Your little sister of the one called the Al Al Aleniac? Aleniac Witch Girl. I'm me and you're, who are you? We're different. You need to believe in yourself more. Well, okay, from now on, you need to believe in the magic that is yours alone. No matter how hard things get, you'll be able to overcome it with your magic. Oh, what? Finding bolts now? Later, leave it till later. If I can do things with my magic, I'll listen to anything. Bang, bang. Okay, if I go this way to hit the save, can I come back? Or I have to go through the whole thing. I think I can come back. I can. Go. Don't mind me, just me and my Castlevania music. I'm totally going to hit no on do you want to continue one of these times on accident. It's going to happen. It's 100% going to happen. Oh, books. I'm faster than the books. Spark. Oh no, there's no magic. If I had to guess, I would say that fire is strong against books. Perhaps. Oh, 
I'm gonna heal. These books are doing Mondo damage. Casted trees. You don't want to freeze a book, you gotta burn the books. How close am I leveling up? Wow, that stance. It's quite the stance. 14. Is there treasures here? Oh, this all goes, they all go to crystals. Um, I take it this is not the right way to go. Yep. All right then. Go this way. Oh god. Oh. This is number one. Oh, I think I get... I get what's happening here. I think. Yo, open that umbrella. Nice. I thought somebody was behind me in real life, and it was just my hair. I scared myself. I spooked myself a little bit. I didn't one-shot it. 20 damage. <gasps> this should kill it. Yes. I need to heal. I need to heal bad. Aqua. I almost read that as something completely different. Almost read that completely differently. Because the Q looked like a CI. Vortex. I like how spinny, spinny, what's a diesel? How much experience do I get from these guys? Like 10? Take a mental note. Because it, it's probably gonna be like a puzzle where I have to hit these in order. So this is gonna be one. And this is I think this one was three. Maybe it was four. I don't know. So front left is one. That's three. Front left is one, back left is three. That means the other one's two. I don't even really need to do it. 
don't even really need to go to it, but I'm going to. Just to see if my assumption is correct. Yep. Yep. So it's it's one, two, three, four. Puzzle boys. Wait a minute. Oh god. Well, that's not right. They're all right, except for... For the red one, which I apparently can't. I was like, he had to be quick on that one. he be real quick. I guess it was one, two, three, three, but... It stopped at three, so... Kind of new. Got it. The door should open. Sis? Sis, where are you, sis? You can't leave the gate from a millennium puzzle like this. Soon you'll be limited to the world you came from. You're open linked. I can't read. Let's just let's just put that on the table right now. <laughs> I can't read. Sis, you say Mmph Mmph Promise. Uh unto little uh can't hear you, sis. Sis? Whoa. And that's how you wound up here, huh? You can do anything with magic if you use it right. Father. Oh, darling, what's the matter? Did you come up with a plan? No, we're stumped. Go figure, eh? Are we in Canada? Sorry, you seem to be bothered by something. I can help if you want. Can you tell me what's wrong? Well, for the past few days, a peaceful humble village has been attacked nightly by monsters. The villagers have not been harmed, but they live in fear of the night. Tonight's meeting was to discuss this monster problem. A monster problem? Let me help, please. What can a girl like you do? Daddy, she knows how to cast magic spells. Leave everything to me. Your troubles are over. I mean, they've just begun. No. While they put the... Okay. Your monsters only attack the wheat fields. This is the one in the... It's the one in the village that's been harmed so far. My dad is out patrolling to make sure those monsters don't try anything. Trail of the Comet, sure. <coughs> Cleaving to the Stars is a comet with its long tail. Do you know the difference between a comet and a meteor? A meteor is a meteorite. Meteoroid. Meteoroid. <laughs> it's drawn by gravity into the atmosphere. A comet, unlike a star, travels in a fixed orbit and appears at regular intervals. Steeped in mystery, comets have inspired many folk tales. Some superstition claim comets to be bad omens, but no one knows why. I always gotta check all the stuff. Mixer of adventurers who explore into ruins and hunt monsters for bounty. It'd be perfect for a job like this. Oh, I'm in a town. 
actually in a town. You can store records of your adventure on a memory card. Memory cards are a thing in the Wild Arms lore. Apparently. Yes. Door's locked. Is that hot enough for you? Door's locked. Door's locked. Door's locked. Everything's locked. I guess it's technically nighttime. It was about, yes, exactly a week ago that the village was first attacked. I remember it well because we were busy harvesting this palace meat. <clears throat> we finished harvesting the all important wheat that the village economy depends on. The granary is chock full of wheat we harvest. Cool. Every door is locked. Oh, I'm, I'm back here. I know how to use magic too. I'm gonna be like you. I'll work hard and I won't give up ever. Oh. Where the heck are the wheat fields? Oh god. Monsters always come from the northeast. The northeast is an unlucky direction. Bad things always come from the northeast. Guess where the greenery in the palace village is? Right in the northeast part of town. I feel somewhat, you know, alright. Village monsters. Monsters aren't after the village or the villagers. They're after the wheat harvest. No one has been hurt. The damage is limited to the wheat in the wheat field. Think of it. The monsters always appear in the northeast. They're back. The monsters. The monsters are attacking. After the greenery. <laughs> Don't panic, just find some place safe to hide. Young lady, give me a hand. Wait, young lady. Oh no, monsters. What is this thing? Boundless glutton monster. Oh no, I'm fighting it already. Oh, he's got parts. I forgot bosses have parts to beat up. Oh no, he's juicing me. Gross. His leg. Are you sure that's his leg? It doesn't look like it's pointing at his leg. Perhaps it is a leg. And it's just not the kind of leg we're thinking about. Hundred and forty one damage. Oh no, he's juicing me again. He's Oh no, not the juice. Not the juice. Mister please, not the juice. Why does he gotta juice this girl, man? Juicy. Yeah, very juicy. God. He wails now. Buffo, buffo. He's not juicing me anymore. He's doing other things now. He's doing dangerous things. Please don't die, Umbrella Girl. Why 
22. Oh, he's not... His body's not weak to frost. I need to heal. Burn the head, freeze the leg. That's the old, that's the old saying. me again. Stop chasing me. Here we are. We're in the 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 of the loop. The boss fight loop. We've successfully made it into the boss fight loop. Every turn plays out exactly the same. Oh, I beat him. Whoa, what a death animation. A hundred experience. And a big berry. Nice. He did. He expanded. He expanded wrong. We did it. We beat them. Hey lady, you drove them off all by yourself? Yes. That's amazing, young lady. You're incredible. Wow, your magic is powerful after all. The kid just called her young lady. So it was your magic, eh? I said, yeah, V for victory, sucker. <laughs> nice. I don't know what would have happened if you hadn't come along. Thank you very much, really. Oh, thank you, sucker. <laughs> You helped me so much too. She she went from being like an okay character to being like a top character just because she yelled sucker. To prepare a better reward. I'm in a hurry. Even though you probably have use for my magic. That's why I'm so happy to receive the teleport gem. Sis, will you come visit me again? <clears throat> of course, I promise. Yahoo! And this time, don't mess up. Yeah. She's gonna mess up. Oops, my shoelaces. What? <laughs> She'll be okay. Oops, my shoelace. I tried to be cool about it, but I might have blown it. I don't think I have been cursed if I had accepted a bag lunch. Well, I have been cursed if I had accepted a bag lunch. Reminds me, I still haven't had breakfast yet. I'm so hungry. Sucker. It'll be okay if I get to the Valeria home. I'm sure they'll feed me. Now that that's settled, I'll be fine. Just fine. Can't come with me if you want to. At least that's what I thought. Poor little cat. Do I get to play as the other dude now? The last prologue. Beep, 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 beep. 
A former hero, now war criminal. He's got cool hair. This guy's named like Brad or something. Five years ago. I thought we chased him in here. They don't know about the oops state. So he be, even he'd be exhausted. He can't be very far. We gotta look some more. Found a bunch of barghests. I'll chase him out. This reminds me of that other time. There wasn't any miserable rain, though. This blood did get spilled, but in an era of delusions, if someone doesn't stand up, even more blood will be shed. Last on through. Don't delay a second. Goku. Hair. Why did we you know why'd they die for something like that? These white screens. No time to get stingy with the ammunition. I have to survive. My name still has meaning. Okay, now the search party recovered these items from the point from point twelve southwest. ID card of a Slayheim Liberation Army soldier. Here, give it to me. Brad. It is Brad. I remembered. It's been like 20 years since I've played any of this game. And I remembered that his name was Brad. Brad Evans. Seed to the recovery point. We must catch him before he gets through the forest. like the only thing I remember about this game. Whoa, the music is bumping. Why is the music in this game so bumping? The bazooka. What are you wearing, Brad? What is that shirt? Dancing. And then we get into a fight and it interrupts the music. But it interrupts it with other music that is pretty good. Oh, he's a punch boy. Hunting time. Wow. Oh. Twenty damage. That's not cool. Block and one. So he's the re in terms of combat abilities, I guess. I guess I didn't. I don't remember what Ash has. Condition green. Is yeah, Brad also level one? Probably. Yep. Damage. 
battles are playing out exactly the same way. Am I going to level up from this? I don't remember. Eight. Yep. Level two, baby. Cruising. Cruising. This, this section really reminds me of Breath of Fire in the way that it looks. 69, dude. Yeah. I like that. Fight. 69 damage again. 67. Close. Almost the big 69. 5 damage. 5 damage. Not bad. Big 69. Another strength apple. Should I use the strength apple on Brad? I don't know. I'm just gonna do what I did in the last game and wait until the end of the game to use any of my apples. So that's how I play my JRPGs. Especially ones that have permanent stat up items, because I wait until the end of the game to use them. Ooh yeah. Take that. Nice. Sixty nine, yeah, buddy. Get it in there. Can I do double sixty nine? Oh, 68. So close. Can you send your favorite character? Yeah, I don't know which character is my favorite yet, though. I'll probably use them, like, halfway through. Like I did. Actually, in Wild Arms 1, I used most of my apples, like, halfway through the game. So turning back once you go over this cliff. Posse is closing in. Even if I die, I can't let my name be dishonored. I am Brad Evans of the Slayheim Liberation Army. And I delay, I must get to the other side of the forest quickly. Okay, yeah, but what about this treasure? Vitality apple. Also, these crates. There could be treasures in these crates. Come on, Brad, think of the treasures. See? Treasures. It's all worth it. What? Who's there? <clears throat> What's a... A puppy. Okay. Don't bark. Did you hear something over there? Whoa. Nah, Mumi. The puppy scared me. What a waste of time. Let's go. I'm not going to let the others get all the credit. But the puppy just saved Brad Evans. So the puppy brought back a berry. Dude, I get a dog? Yo, I get a dog! This game just got infinitely cooler. I want to go 
the other way in case there's treasure. Well, I don't I don't know. What's this? Door seems to be rusted. Can we break it? Save point. <clears throat> Yo, I got the pupper inside. Save the pupper. This is no longer wild arms. This is wild pupper. I'll go best companion. Yes. We have to save the pupper. Protect the pupper. Oh, a chest. Kick boots. Living the shackle cause all kinds of things to happen. Ooh, yeah. Wow. Check it now, boys. Oh. Boom. They really had to play it three times? I mean, I guess. I know there's a treasure over here. I saw it earlier. We gotta save the doggo. Don't let the doggo get hurt. 69 damage? 66 damage. Darn. Owl. Miss. Okay. 60, no 69s. Darn. How close am I leveling up? That's <laughs> 51. Big berry. All right. Then. Come on, doggo. I don't know where the doggo is. Doggo got lost. Doggo? There he is. Can I kick the? I can't. I just have to pick him up. Guy with his goku hair. <clears throat> I was surprised. How was I surprised? We gotta protect my doggo from these other doggos. The bad doggos. 64. Wow, I didn't kill him. Impressive. Slow, a little slow pupper. As long as he keeps coming, I don't care. Here he is. He's stuck on the wall. Poor little pupper. Careful, pupper. Yo, the pupper jump. God. That was dangerous. I think about the pupper more. Poor little pupper. I know it just ran into the forest. Dangerous criminal? Maybe a very pale degenerate? <clears throat> Who knows? All I know is that we haven't been told anything and there's no need for us to know either. What would you do if he suddenly jumped out here? It would be a bad idea for us to catch him and get the credit. With your word, I'll get our horse and return to Tebok Village. I'll end my mercenary work. I keep babbling, the search team will beat me silly. Don't worry here. Search is conscripted recently. That means there's a village nearby. What's that voice I hear? The monster. Even the village animals have been attacked by it. Let's get out of here. We're in over our heads. Where are we going? How will we get there? 
You guys are such trouble. You, you're, just stay down. Let's go. Let's fight the evil thing. Oh, what is that? Parasite Colony Monster. Grimalkin. Oh god. Sure herself assured, Brad Evans. I'm gonna handle your pursuers. The boss monster. Sure, I'll show you what it means to be a hero. Take care of this before the incident gets any bigger. What the heck? Mini grenades. Oh, that's a beat up the belly. Punch the belly. 77. Parasite Battalion. Oh, God. Get bazooka Two hundred and forty-two ring burst. Oh, his belly's still <laughs> his belly's still uh still alive. I think I can survive another hit. Is it done over sixty damage? Chest buster. Oh God. I think I can attack it again. Okay, I need to heal after this. For sure. Yep. The bell is still alive. Belly. Bazooka. 256. Okay, I think his belly's done. Yep. I should I should survive another roaring burst. As long as I go first next turn. Ooh. Close. Dumb head. He's still alive. Shoot him in his big dumb head again. He's dead. Disintegrated. Nice. Level three. <laughs> you know what the bazooka? The big bazooka works every time. Saved us. Hey. Fighting is even more powerful than it was rumored to be. I don't know if our forces are strong enough to defeat him. 
There's a village on the other side of the forest, right? I've got an idea. Wait, Brad Evans. Okay, what are they doing? Do it. Don't do it. I'm out of the forest. I need a place to hide. What about that place? What, the signpost? North Cape. Ebok Village. Move ahead in your story. Your next destination will become clear. However, places you have never visited do not appear in the field with a map symbol. There you the search system. Press the square button while in the field. Use the search system and info about your destination to find map symbols. Interesting. Due northwest from here. Where are you, Teapot Village? There you are. You made it. The village of Teabok. Oh, the, the pupper. The pupper came with. So this is it. Not the pupper. I'm so glad you woke up. You were sleeping so deeply, I thought you'd never wake up. Where am I? You're in Teabok Village, in a stable. But all the horses are gone. My name's Merrill. Okay, now can I ask you something? Is this puppy your friend? Yeah, he is my friend. This is a very smart dog. He's the one who told me you were passed out in the rain. What's this dog's name? Rat Raz you Raz you What a name I should have named him Pupper I should leave this village right away Why oh, you still need to rest Man, I'll get you something to eat Brad You're not afraid of me You're not a bad man can't do that in this village. Our intention was not to cause such a stir. What we do for the sake. What we do is for the sake of your village. Stay here, mister. Don't worry. Rass you and I will stay with you. Rass you. I'm gonna call him Pupper. There aren't any bad people in this village. Hiding here will only bring your village misfortune. Surely you realize that. Hey, mister. Your name's not Mr. Sides. Makes me sound old. So there you are. So it's you, Brad Evans. I came to deliver something that you lost. So you want to take us on? It's fine, I need but realize that innocent villagers may be hit by stray bullets. Oh, God. That's not something you want to say with all those people right there. Seize him. Why is it the two green guys got to do it? We have to do this for all from this village. Is that man a bad man? A bad man. Oh, you got it all wrong. Now listen, young lady. That man is a hero. A hero? Ha 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 ho 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 ha 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 ho 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 ha ha <laughs> This fades over fades Perhaps it's better this way All I know is fighting if I kept going on if I kept on going all I would find is more blood and death Poor bread 
few places for someone whose only true home is on the battlefield. Consider this a vacation. After all, heroes aren't needed once the shooting stops. Peace means a world that needs no heroes, and that has to be better. And then the curtain fades. Then I save. Next. The comet has disrupted the heavens. I need to do something. I must hurry. Whoa, whoops, heaven forbid. put a hat on and then she was smoking. Town of Maria. Oh, is that the kid that was kidnapped? Is that Tony? Tony. Oh my eyes, too bright. Who opened the curtains? Who do you think? It's me, sleepyhead. It's me, the innkeeper's daughter, Marina. Yeah, the cardboard emotes are are adorable. Find a quarters, not on leave. I'm confined to quarters, not on leave. Don't you get it? Well, from here, I don't see any difference. Anyway, you have visitors. Visitors, really? Me? I wonder who it is. It's Tony. Of course, it's Tony. Hugging a fat cat, that is the best. Wait, is that? it is. Is that a picture? Is that picture what I think that picture is? We're out of here. Anime in my anime game. I am robbing this, this poor inn of all of its apples. Yeah. Yeah. You know, I don't, I, I mean, if, if there is, I'm also unaware of it. Unless the Wild Arms devs are just fans. Or maybe it's the same, maybe the dude who did the anime intro for Wild Arms is connected to it somehow. Who knows? Dude, what's up? Thanks for helping out the other day. Oh yeah, at the Withered Ruins. How have you been, Tony? Excellent, as you can see. But I wouldn't be if you hadn't rescued me, dude. Here's a dragon with fans of wild arms. These wild arms too are fans of dragon. Oh, there you go. Hi, I'm Ash. Nice to meet you. It's two of friends of mine. 
Okay. Nice to meet you. We have Scott. What are these names? We're helping our dear friend the other day. In my humble opinion, you would seem to be a very good person. Please make your friends. Hello. Tim. Three of us hang out together because we're all orphans. Oh god, it's so sad. <laughs> we're so glad that our dear friend Tony is alright. Thank you, Ash. Came here to thank you and to ask you a favor. A favor? Yeah, helping people is your job, right? But we need your help. We can't do this on our own. Okay. I need you to catch a cat. Actually, a kitten. Did you catch a cat? Oh no. This is embarrassing, but. This kitten made off with a treasure of ours. It's the kitten up there on the roof. In my humble opinion, it looks bad to have this happen to us. I understand isn't able to remedy the situation as the kitten is on our roof. But by our chasing it, the kitten refuses to descend. So These kids are really smart for being orphans. Not that orphans are dumb. It's just, they, they talk very sophisticated, is what I mean. Sorry to bother you, but can you do something? I'm used to, like, orphans and JRPGs being, like, you know, they're typically, like, portrayed as, like, thieves and, like, hood rats and little, little hoodlums. These orphans, they're like, please, sir, may you help us in our thing? Heck, oh, no, I didn't mean it like that. I didn't mean it like that. Can to help us, dude? Our pride is at stake here. Every orphan. Every, every single one of them. Poor orphans. Item shop. Can I buy a new weapon? Do I even have money? Here's Merkel shop here, or so they say. This is the place for items. Rhino shot. Oh, I have a lot of money. Buy one of all of these things, I bet. I like that it tells me that I have that they do parentheses plus one. I am, I am rolling, rolling in all the gella. Give me all that gella. Let's just get ten of eight, all of these things. There we go. There we go. There's no skills are cool, so we have an off challenge or something. What is Oh. 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 Sudden death attack resistance. See? They're smart. I still don't like sudden death attacks, but at least there's an in game way to somewhat deal with it. There's actually a resistance for it. 
It's not just, oh, ha ha ha, you dead. Eat a suck wagon. I traveled all around for a guy, and I like this place. The climate is tolerable, and the monsters do not cause too much damage. So I gotta look around in this house. Look for apples. I saved and had a hole in the ceiling. Truly outrageous. So I complained and had them put me in this room instead. Hole in the ceiling, huh? You don't say. Is it this room? This room looks nicer than the other room, though. That one hundred percent persistence. Then it's trash! This game is trash! Okay, here's the save person. I think that is gonna be where I end for today. We got a little ways into Wild Arms 2, which is good. 